For 10 years, folks in the Borderlands community have wowed us with their passion, with their creativity, and with their talent. With the 10 years of Borderlands cosplay contest, we really wanted to shine a light on that. There's a real family feel to this. There's a real welcoming nature to this community. And the breadth and diversity of characters within the series really provides an amazing canvas for anyone wanting to cosplay, wanting to enjoy this wider community. Well, being part of the Borderlands community is, is amazing. Everyone is so supportive of each other. We all talk to each other, we're in a big group chat. So we're all supporting each other, giving each other's tips. I've never felt more welcomed, more accepted in a community. Everybody is just so loving. It's a competition, but there is no competition. Everybody's so supportive of everybody. And it's just been a wonderful experience. We knew we'd need a little bit of help when it came to the judging. And so we turned to two people with an exceptional level of knowledge when it came to cosplay itself, but also a fundamental understanding of the unique challenges that cosplaying Borderlands presents. And so with that in mind, we chose Kelly Jean and Hannah Lydia. As for the judging itself, the enormously high bar of quality meant that we needed an incredibly rigorous judging process. We looked at everything right down to the very, very nitty gritty of character detail as well. And for the final in particular, we had to take character difficulty into consideration. We literally sat there and deliberated for an hour. Everyone was just so incredibly talented. Six months, three heats, 20 cosplayers. It's all come down to this, the grand final of the 10 Years of Borderlands cosplay contest. Alex Cosplay's foam work meant that his Mordecai was exceptionally consistent, both in terms of its structure, look, and painting. I've been cosplaying for about five years, but I've never had the guts to enter a competition before. So seeing this come up, it was very short notice. I wasn't expecting it to be as soon as it was when I went to Insomnia, but it just gave me a bit more of a kick to actually do something and push myself out of my comfort zone. We really love the personal touch to Hand Soap Cosplay's Krieg. Not only was his bodysuit entirely made from scratch, but he was cosplaying his Krieg, his variant, and the prop work was phenomenal. And looking around, I was surprised I was even amongst the other people. Like, everyone's detail is ridiculous. Borderlands just takes it to a whole different level. The props, everyone's got amazing props. It was just looking at everyone else that just strived you to be even better. Finally, at the end of this long journey, we had our winner, Toya Jax as Gage from Borderlands 2. Toya Jax as Gage just stands out. Like in, in life, on stage, it really pops. It looks like she walks straight out of the game. Like her props, everything. She just nailed it. I don't think my emotions have caught up with me yet. It was amazing. Everyone's like, congratulations, which is cool because everyone's really lovely here. I started my Gage costume in 2014 and then I realized there was so much stuff and it was really intimidating and I gave up. And then I was talking to other Borderlands cosplayers and I brought it back out and I started again. And then I just keep improving little tiny things each time. How would I sum up this whole competition? Um, I'm really glad that it happened because you don't get very many opportunities like this. Um, and it's really nice to see a games company that not only cares about the community, but their cosplayers too. And they recognize that they're an important part of what makes it great. Um, so yeah, I'm very happy for that. And I don't think there's any meet other than Borderlands where you just walk up to other cosplayers and you're like, hi, and you're basically already friends. And everyone's really chatty and lovely. And I probably wouldn't still be cosplaying if it wasn't for all these amazing people. And so that was the 10 years of Borderlands cosplay contest. But it's not really about the contest. It's about the community. And this community has been the most supportive, passionate, wonderful group of people. So here's to you, a very big thank you.